What's going on guys? It's your boy Agen back again for another Alchemy Stars video. And for today, it's the usual should you summon video because in the upcoming update, we will be getting a new 6 star which is Tiare. Yeah, Tiare skill set are already available in the news. So if you have not been uh, paying attention to the news, well, here it is. Let us go ahead to the official subreddit for Alchemy Stars. Uh, we have here the Aurorian abilities for Tiare. Tiare is, looks really, really good. I'm not into Perry, but I really love her design. Uh, yeah, the legs, the legs is uh, really, really nice. But as you can see, the shot here. Yeah, if you are into boobas, then yeah, she also got the nice boobs. But me, I am a legs enjoyer, and this one looks really, really nice. So Paxi Habris Tiare. She is a Thunder Detonator. Yeah. So, 6 star Thunder Water Detonator. Uh, just to note that uh, the following uh, stats here represents the Aurorian's initial stats and their fully upgraded stats at max affinity. So, Aurorian attributes 3,844 attack, 1,306 defense, and 11,329 HP. Her stats are pretty, pretty high in my honest opinion. Let us see how high uh, uh, the strongest Thunder Aurorian right now. Uh, where is my uh, Aurorian? Thunder. Revy at max level, max affinity, only has 3,652. Uh, Reynard, a sniper, only has 3,500. Uh, and then, uh, oh, Alter Rat is 3,811. 3,811. I think Alter Rat, as of now, is, is the one the, that has the most attack stat. But enter here, enter here Tiare, which has uh, 3,844. So this one is already above. Alter Rat and uh, with regards to her HP almost pretty much the same 11,194 here for Alter Rat no it's still higher than Alter Rat same with the defense ah no the defense is uh, Alter Rat has more defense compared to uh, Tiare but yeah regarding the attack stat and the HP stat Tiare uh, surpasses Alter Rat when it comes to those stats Active skill, <coughs> excuse. Active skill enhancement. So she's probably going to have some equipment enhancement since we have we are getting this information here. So we have your changes. Active skill to preemptive strike available upon entering combat inflicts one. Or maybe this is the breakthrough. I'm not sure if this is the equipment upgrade or maybe the BT upgrades. Probably this one is going to be BT three upgrade and then mbt they did not specify but if this is going to be the breakthrough upgrades then it's really nice for them to already include the important breakthrough upgrades here so because uh, if this is going to be a uh, ex equipment uh, upgrade then uh, you only need one copy of her to have the preemptive strike just upgrade her equipment like this but I don't think it's going to be like that. So it's probably going to be the BT3 upgrade and then the MBT. Uh, her active skill, IC Acrimony with a two rounds cooldown. Her active skill is water element, right? Why is she thunder? Also, her art is uh, screams uh, all blue. Why is she thunder? Man, come on. So. Her active skill, IC Acrimony, targets one tile to inflict 250% damage to the cone shape area in that direction, inflicting two weak points on the enemies within the range in that direction. I cannot uh, picture out this type of uh, active skill. I need to see this uh, and I need to test this one in the Aurorian Trial to see it first. How strong this one really is. I cannot get my, my head into this one. I'm sorry about that one. 
Her chain combo shattering skies. Ah, uh, with a 5, 10, 14 chain activations. Ah, uh, ew. <laughs> she is a detonator, but her detonator chains are somewhat ew. It's not a uh, two surrounding cluster. Two surrounding cluster for detonator glass are still the best chain combo, hands down. Uh, but maybe she can to do with uh, what she has because this one is uh, damage in a column and to adja adjacent tiles along the path towards the nearest enemy also breaks up to two weak spots in that direction ah, interesting column is uh, the same like Revy, right yeah Column is the same as uh, Rebi's uh, active skill chain. I mean, uh, chain combo. So yeah, they did not specify how many columns. But it seems that it is go it, this is going to be a uh, three column, just like the same with Rebi. That's just my wild guess for this one. Her equipment skill, Thunder and Sky, as one. When passing through dark tiles or entering aurora time, Tiare will inflict one weak spot with a 50% chance for one extra weak spot on the enemy with the biggest HP on the field in the direction closest to her. Whenever Tiare's normal attack or chain combo strikes in that direction, the weak spots will be broken resulting in 230% splash damage and 100% damage to the splash range. When an enemy dies, its weak spot transfers to the nearest enemy. When an enemy is surrounded by weak spots, an additional half of the break damage will be inflicted. So yeah, that, that is the end of uh, Tiare's skill set. Now, Tiare will uh, definitely benefit from uh, Dark Tiles. I believe the only Dark Tile enabler or Dark Tile Thunder Converter in the Thunder element is Jenny. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, I did some summons for Jenny before, but I was not able to get her. I believe Jenny is the only one that can uh, make some Thunder Dark Tiles. Also, um, there is one. There is one, the Tick Waifu. Uh, I, I believe I have her. Ah, Isa. Yeah, Isa. Yeah, Isa is also a uh, dark tile generator, but she is a detonator also. So Isa plus Jenny plus uh, Tiare will probably are the the best uh, teammates for uh, Tiare. Those three, I don't know, but Thunder is already pretty stuck. If you've been playing around for quite some time. You probably have a lot of uh, characters already like I have but in my case I've been playing since day one so I have this much uh, character so I'm only summoning for the character I want not the, the meta that I want <coughs> excuse and my thunder is already pretty pretty stuck I'm only looking forward to support characters like tile converters dark tile converters something like that or a waifu that I really, really want. Tiare is waifu, but I'm not really sold out uh, with just uh, her looks. Uh, because third year anniversary is just on the horizon. If you don't know, third year anniversary of Alchemy Stars is going to be on June. Uh, June second week, probably. And March is almost, uh, we are already in the third week of March, right? So... After March, April, and then uh, May, we already have the preview for the upcoming event for the month of May, which is uh, the Redisal Range event. I've already talked that one on my uh, another video, so just make sure uh, make sure to watch that one also. Should uh, summon for Tiare? If you really like her design, if you really love her. As, as a character then go ahead and summon for her 
If you are someone who are looking for a strong DPS character, just test her out first in the Aurorian Trial before you decide to summon for her because uh, just by reading her skill set, it's really best to, to see and test her out in the Aurorian Trial first uh, before we can say that she's going to be a really powerful detonator. But her stats are already through the roof in my honest opinion. Uh, they are already above the exclusive limited character like Alter Rat. Uh, yeah, the, the attack stat is really, really, really nice. And also, she's she's got some uh, some form of splash damage, which is uh, might be really, really good for Desolation Codex if you are uh, someone that uh, has been trying to climb the ladder in the if you're a, a competitive player in the in the leaderboards, then maybe. She's going to do a great ton of damage in Desolation Codex, but if you're just a collector or just a casual player, just like me, uh, and also uh, in my case, I already have a lot of characters raised, uh, I'm just looking out for a character that I really, really want and I really, really want to play with. Anyways, I think that's it for me for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you could help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time, peace.